Premium is withdrawn by the partners. A and B are partners sharing profits and losses equally. They value goodwill at 3,50,000. Admit C with a new profit sharing ratio 3 is to 2 is to 2. C brings in capital of 5 lakh his share of goodwill premium. Assuming that no goodwill appears in the balance sheet and the goodwill premium is withdrawn by the partner's past journal entries. So basically, it is the same problem as before. The only extra thing is that the money is withdrawn by the partners. So what are our entries? We know the working, we know the entries already. Cash which is brought in, cash account debit to seize capital account. The total amount which is brought in is how much? 5 lakh for capital and 1 lakh towards goodwill premium. Therefore, the total amount would be 6 lakh. This is the amount which is brought in by C. Next, for goodwill premium, we will credit the old partners. So, C's capital account debit. We've already done this. 1 lakh, his share of goodwill. To A, to B, what ratio? Sacrificing ratio, which was 1 is to 3, 25,000 and 75,000. Next, it is withdrawn by the partners. Therefore, what is the entry for withdrawing? A's capital account debit, B's capital account debit, how much? 25,000, 75,000 to bank. What happens is that money is no longer retained in the business. This is a neater presentation of the same thing. Cash brought in, 6 lakh. Cash account debit to C's capital account. C's share, C's capital account debit, 1 lakh to A's to B's. And additional entry, A's capital 25,000, B's capital 75,000 to cash because they are withdrawing that amount. So cash is not retained in the business.